the plates that we put together, they're, they're massive. We uh, advertise we're Northern Ontario's biggest portions because we back that up. Um, to some, it, maybe it's too much food where we hear about that, but a lot of people come because they know this is the home of huge portions. I was 13 years old, I was a dishwasher at the Blue Boy for the Chindamo family and I just learned from there to move into every department, pizzas in the line and a great boss of mine, Chester Addison, said that maybe it's time that you fly your own wings and try your own place and God bless his soul, he's a great man. Um, and I did, just went out on a whim and uh, there we are. You've seen the Panzerati, it's, uh, it's five pounds. Yeah. <laughs> um, we just hang on to that because it's been five pounds for years. Uh, we have Bucci Burgers and uh, Gabriel, uh, Bambino Gabriel Burgers, named after my grandson. We have a Princess Leah sandwich named after my granddaughter. So we have some favorites that we like to specialize and we sell a lot of them. Our ribs, our fish, our fish fries on Friday, our all-you-can-eat wing buffet on Saturdays. There's eight different flavors of uh, wings, salad bar and fries included. Thursday night's an all-you-can-eat poutine bar. You build your own poutine on the buffet with multiple items. I mean, we had four locations. Uh, we had Iron Bridge, Bruce Mines, we're at the Caswell here, or the other location actually. And um, you know what, it's, uh, it's nice to have that name as a staple or a household name in this region. Um, but like I said, it comes with a lot of dedication and hard work. You know what, it's quality of food and price points that uh, keep people happy, but I think generally it's the, the stigma of the place. The, the, you know, the reputation of greeting, being greeted, fun staff, um, everybody here enjoys their jobs, they've been here for a while, and it's just a happy family. Um, you look at people having uh, families and they were just newborns, and then all of a sudden, 20 plus years later, they're all young adults. Um, how many families have you fed in all the years? Watch their develop and grow as families. Now they come in as young adults with their families starting. You know what, it's very gratifying. Uh, that's the, the special part. And you watch all the people you've known for all the years, um, you know, develop into friends and, and neighbors. And the thing is, uh, the schools, you know, you watch all the young kids that you feed pizzas to every Friday. And you, you know, you watch them graduate out of grade seven and eight and move on and then you see them in high school years. So that's the gratifying part.